Back doing smoke. Today we're going to be doing tribute to the one and only legendary blues musician Hallow Wolf. As a blues man himself, I'm pretty damn sure he appreciates some damn good southern style ribs. And we're cooking these baby back ribs low and slow. We're going to be serving it with a sauce by the spoonful that will definitely have moaning all night, my friends. So let's get started. I'm going to prepare them with a simple method of creating a mustard slather and just putting all my rub. Now, a mustard slather is commonly used in barbecue. What I like to do is just like I just did right now, put a little bit of the yellow mustard and I like to put some dashes of Worcestershire and I just get it all up in there. All right, now I'm gonna apply the rub. Be generous. Okay, we're gonna put the ribs on the grill now. You want to be a little bit quick with this because your temperature, you know, you want to stabilize it. Put the lid back on. We're going to let these smoke for about, usually goes for like three to four hours. So we'll see you then. All right, so let's get started on the sauce I was talking about. And of course, we're going to start with some good old bourbon right here. There we go, that's about a, maybe a half cup. I got some brown sugar right here. Another barbecue sauce staple. And I have uh, some ketchup right here. Make sure you use some good quality. This is just Heinz. And I have my heat right here. This is a, a trio of hot sauces I've mixed up. I have a Chipotle one. I have Frank's Red, and I have a little bit of this red jalapeno sauce I got down in Tijuana. I'm gonna add the rest of the mustard. Salt, pepper, onion powder, garlic powder, basic. I'm mix this up. Now down the heat a bit more, I'm going to add some molasses, and again, this is going to add more richness. And last but not least, my favorite, the imperils. Right now I got my sauce all mixed up right here. I'm going to take this to the stove, I'm going to put it over low heat, and like I said, I'm going to cook it as long as the ribs take. So, we'll see you then. All right, so it's been about two hours in this cook, and um, it's time to do what is known as mopping. Now, here they are. Now, here is a mixture of just Coke, butter, a little bit of cider vinegar, and just a little bit of uh, hot sauce. That's it. And you just want to gently pat it down and let it come down. And at this point, you're going to want to do this at every hour. So we're at two hours right now. These ribs still probably got another hour and a half to go. All right, so it's been about three and a half hours, and it's time to take these baby backs off the grill. All as you all. <laughs> Look at that. Amazing bark right there. Right, to cut ribs, it's easier to do it when they're upside down. So you just grab them, turn them over, and that way you can see the bones better. So I have my sauce right here, like I said, I reduced this for about three and a half hours, same time as the ribs. And I'm doing this the old fashioned way by finishing it with some butter right here. Just let that melt in the sauce while it's still really hot. We're saucing these ribs about the spoonful. 
Last but not least, we're gonna give this sauce literally a nice kick of the south with some bourbon. Just to remind everyone, it's the end. About a spoonful. After for some water, she gave me this barbecue sauce. Now it's on these ribs. And it's gonna be in my belly soon. Hey, if you like what you see here, hit us with the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and thanks for watching. See you soon. A lot of people wonder, what is the blues? I hear a lot of people saying the blues, the blues, but I'm gonna tell you what the blues is. When you ain't got no money, you got the blue. When you ain't got no money to pay your house rent, you still got the blue. A lot of people holler about, I don't like no blue, but when you ain't got no money and can't pay your house rent and can't buy you no food, you damn sure got the blue.